What's the chat and channels? Lantern Joe here. Welcome back to another episode of the Pokemon and Black and White Free Nuzlocke. In the last episode, we made it right here to Driftvale City, and today we are starting our ascent into the Pokemon World Tournament. I'm a little scared of what's going to come up here. I am a little scared. I hope I can do well. In this fight, but we'll see how well we do. My team is good going into this. I'm going to give the pink bow to Pitbull to boost uh, uh, to boost uh, play rough. I think that's basically all I can do here. Let's do this. I kind of know a little bit of what's going on because I kind of have a failed recording. Yeah, I've been basically I've just been recording most of an entire episode and I didn't even realize I was actually not recording my voice. So, yeah. Hi, welcome to the Pokemon World Tournament. We are accepting applications for the qualifiers now. Would you like to enter? Yes, please come this way. So technically I've already done this. I got up to the semi-finals before I realised uh, is that we were basically not recording. Well, we kind of... I was recording the gameplay, and I have gameplay that I could show you, but without audio, it's not really worth it, so... I'm not going to show you that gameplay, because there's really no point. I'll just count that as a failed recording and uh, try and learn from it. So I'm not going into this blind, which is kind of annoying. And Man City's just scored. Yeah, it's Man City's playing Everton right now as we speak as I'm playing this, as I'm recording this episode. Because I record on a Saturday. And it's Saturday. So, football is being played, because that's when football is played, of the British kind. I know you guys in America play tomorrow, because that's the big day, that's the Super Bowl, it's a big game. And if you're a Chiefs or a uh, Ray... Uh, no, no, I can't remember who the other side is. I know the Chiefs got through. Is it the Ravens? I don't know. Either way. I know the chief got through. And we're learning Parish Song. I don't need that. Back in my younger days, I would have actually stayed up to watch the uh, Super Bowl, but I'm an old man now. So I will very much not be staying up to watch the Super Bowl. I don't even stay up to watch wrestling pay per views anymore these days. I just watch them more. I just watch them in the morning afterwards if I can, uh, with access to the network or the Fight TV, or other ways, which I will very much not discuss on this battle. But, uh, 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 well, that I know of that uh, would get me into trouble if I told people that I know them. So I will not be talking about them. because I'm just very much not talking about those ways that I know. Anyway, as I was saying, I just don't stay up to watch wrestling pay-per-views anymore because I'm an old man now. I'm not that old, I'm 35, but, you know. Just, I ain't what I used to be. I like my sleep. I need, I need sleep, so. I should probably, you know, do the sleepy thing.
So, yeah, I don't stay up to watch wrestling pay-per-views. I mean, at least this next wrestling pay-per-view that's coming up in the next few weeks, uh, Elimination Chamber is in Perth, uh, which means, in other words, it's actually bright and early in the morning for me. I can watch it whilst eating breakfast. Because it's a Saturday morning, 9.30 in the air. It's Saturday morning, 9.30. And if you're in America, it's very early in the morning for you, so I don't know if you want to stay up for it, but you might. Right, now we are back to where we are. Uh, we are back to the first round of the uh, Pokemon League tournament, the uh, Pokemon World tournament. Congratulations on qualifying for the Pokemon World Tournament. I'm Clay, I'll be your host for this event. Let's go ahead and introduce our contestants. From Humala City, Gym Leader Marlon. Aspers you're not Aspersia City's Gym Leader, you're a Striaton City's Gym Leader. Dryerton City, Aspersi is the little town that is next to uh, Stryerton. Stryerton City, Gym Leader, Cher. Oh, wait, no. Oh, it's Cheron. Asper yeah, it is Aspersia City, then. Aspersia City, Gym Leader, Cheron. Former Pokemon League champion, Aris. And. Uh, Unova's very own Pokemon Professor, Professor Bianca, and her former mentor, Professor Juniper. Also, we have some new uh, contestants here today, too. From the qualifiers, Pokemon Trainer Infern, and Pokemon Trainer Joanne, and a mysterious man known as Vol. Alright, let's get into it. I'll be drawing your names randomly. Once I've drawn your names, pair off into a battle in the battle room. Winners move on to the next round. Now then, let's draw the first pair. We have Marlon. And you'll be facing Infern. And the winner is Infern. Now then, we have the next draw. We have Bianca and Joanne. Oh, it looks like I'm going to be fighting you in my next match, Joanne. Let's do this, Bianca. The winner of this match will move on to the second round. Contestants prepare to battle. I'll now get to see firsthand how strong you are, Joanne. Alright. Let's do this. Nice Drain Punch does nice damage. And in her... By the way, in her other match that we had, actually she switched out to a Pig Knight here. Instead of coming out into it now. I mean, I'm still going to do the exact same strategy I did before, which is switching to Moon. We go for the damage with the Psychic and see how much we can do, and hopefully we'll kill. Nice. I 
and a doo-wop. Kind of want to go back into Mario here on this play. Could go into uh, Elisa as well. Don't like the swords. But I outspeed and seed bomb should do a lot of damage. Beautiful. Alright, what do you got for me next? Mushana. I think my play is Sting here. Okay, you can't psychic me. And Night Slash should do a lot of damage. And look at that, I got the crit. Which I didn't get in the first recording. And Servine. Poison Sting does a lot of damage. Got the poison off, which is nice. Glare is annoying, but as long as I actually hit the poison fang, I should be fine. Good as Marlon said you were. Marlon sure right to uh, pick you to be a Pokemon trainer. And the winner is Pokemon Trainer Joanne. Congratulations, you'll be moving on to the next battle. Now let's draw the next match. We have Iris and Professor Juniper. Looks like I'll be battling Professor Juniper. I was hoping to face the former Pokemon League champion at some point, but I didn't expect it to be this early. And the winner is Professor Juniper. And it leaves two more contestants to draw. The last matchup will be Charon and Volo. I'll give it my all in this battle. And the winner is Volo. And with that, the first round is done. Congratulations to all who are still here. Lots of newcomers making a big splash here today. Our second round matchups are. It's going to start with Infern and. Joanne. I was hoping that I'd be drawn against you. You better not disappoint me. I've been waiting for a rematch against you. This time I'll show you how strong I've become. Come on! Let's do this. I'm a little scared of the. Uh, I'm a little scared of what this thing is going to do because Aquabags is going to hurt if it has it. It could have rocked. It could have rocked to Bulldoze, so flying types are not that good here as well. 
Poison types wouldn't be that great either because of that, uh, of the same reason. So pit bull is my really my only play, really. Yeah, magnitude. I was thinking, I was thinking bulldoze, but yeah, magnitude's just as bad. And rock tomb probably won't do a lot of damage, but it's not stab. And also, I don't... I think Ground Resist Rock. So let's go with a Pink Bow Boosted uh, Play Rough. I can take one more of those. Pink Bow Boosted Ball. Nice. And Lucario. It's a scary Pokemon to be dealing with. I'm gonna go with Mario. Iron Head I resist. I got a crit even though I resist. Well, at least I remember to buy potions, unlike the last map, uh, unless the unlike the last recording where I didn't buy potions at all. Where are my potions? Okay, I take that. Drain punch. Level fifteen. I mean, at least I kill. Two nail man city now. That's annoying. I mean it's city, so we're just expecting us to get destroyed really. Flamethrower. I can take this. You're specially beefy. But you're not that beefy. Because of, because of a crit, now I gotta heal. I don't like that. And you were drawing into Lavitar. I mean, at least I do a lot of damage. I'm going to withdraw two. Magnitude! Oh, thank God for magnitude four. A crit, but it does nothing but it's magnitude four. Players still stink. Can I take a flamethrower? Last time you crit me. I mean, I still take that, but it does a lot of damage. I'd prefer to go back up to full health. Cursed again. Oh, damn it, what are you, strength? That was my misplay. I mean, at least I know I'm faster.
Problem is, though, I'm gonna get cursed. I'm not gonna get cursed. I didn't get cursed. Okay. Because I took out the curse mon. Alright, discharge. Thank you for missing your aqua tail. I could have also gone into Mario here, but Mario was a bit leaf. Uh, Mario had less HP, so I made the right play. Went for Elisa. Nice work, Elisa. You're already pretty fast. I don't need you to be faster. God of War. You're shiny, God of War, too. I mean, Acrobatics is going to do quite a bit of damage. Not as much as I wanted it to. Discharge do more? Does decent. And another one would kill from here. Paralysis. Nice. I could. I hope I can take this. I hope I can take this. I hope I can take this. I did. a fluke. You may have won today, but I will defeat you. Thank you for healing me. Oh, what a fight. I hope Vola doesn't have Giratina. And the winner is... Joanne. Congratulations on winning uh, the first uh, being the first to make the finals. And that leaves our second pair. Professor Juniper and Mysterious Man Vola. This guy must be strong if he was able to beat Sharon. Better be careful. And the winner is... Volo. Well, it looks like we're down to our last two contestants. Pokemon Trainer Joanne and Mysterious Man Volo. Please enter the arena. Congratulations to both of you on for making it to the final round. One of this will become the Pokemon World Champion. Con contestants. Prepare to bow. Alright, let's do this. Okay, Volo starts with a Sneasel. not faster than this thing, so I'm not going to go for the Drain Punch because I'm not going to be faster than it. I like the fact that my Screech, fa uh, screech failed. Didn't fail that time. Or a Spear. Do nice damage. Pillow Swan. Oh, I mean, I do outspeed. I'm sure I can probably take whatever it does. Unless it does that. 
Take it, 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 take it,
Pitbull knows that Pit that he's got a captain this team now that Vince is gone. Congratulations, Joanne. You are the Pokemon World Champion. Allow me to heal your team. That doesn't bring bits back. Now then, please exit the competition room and receive your prize. Congratulations, Joanne. Pretty impressive performance, especially from a newcomer. On behalf of the Pokemon World Tournament, please accept our prize. The Master Ball! And that concludes the Pokemon World Championship. Hey, your silence. You do not realize who you are speaking to. Allow me to show you. It's Senzolan of Team Plasma. You were supposed to be locked up in jail. I have been plotting my escape. You, but uh, while you, uh, you were all lazing away with your tournaments, the shadows of Team Plasma recognize my greatness and crowned me their king. This whole event was just a ruse to hide my escape. Joanne, you okay? I knew something was fi I knew something fishy was going on. So, ha 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 ha! You're too late. Our plans have been put into motion. Let the world know that Team Plasma has returned, and soon Unova will be ours. Come on, Infern, we're off. Wait, stop! Rude? I'm too late, she's gone with him. Hold on a second. I'm very sorry. Please train us. Come with me and I'll explain. My name is Rude. And I run the Pokemon Shelter here in Driftvale City. I am also a former member of Team Plasma. You have to understand, when we started Team Plasma. We were supposed to be dedicated to helping Pokemon, but we were deceived. Since I learned our leader's true intentions, I have dedicated my life to helping abandoned Pokemon. But it seems some of the sages are still loyal to the deceivers. Some possibility not there of their own. So probably not of their own violation. When I saw the commotion in town, I knew Zinzolan was planning something. But I never thought I'd, I'd see her with him. You see, that girl Infern is my granddaughter. I raised her since she was little. She always loved Pokemon, but I never allowed her to train them. But I fear that it may have led her to her resentment. One day, she grew so angry that she left home and never returned. Today, she is the first, it's the first time I've seen her in face in years. I fear she's being deceived. I fear she's going to be used as a pawn in some mischievous scheme just like I was. So please, save her from Team Plasma. I beg you. It's not much, but I can offer you this to help you. HMO5 Waterfall. Certainly, uh, when we encountered Team Plasma, we tried to cover it up. Of course. Thank you so much. I am sort of concerned, though. 
I didn't see Professor Juniper after the World Tournament. Oh yeah, that is strange. I wonder where she could have gone. Well, it's been good seeing you, Johan. I need to get back to my gym in Aspersia. Oh, and I need to return to the Pokemon Lab. Good luck on your journey, Johan. I guess it's down to me. I mean, you, you gonna give me a Pokemon? Yeah. I need to make room for this Pokemon. It's a good thing I have. Uh, good thing Bits is dead. So I can get whatever this is. Actually, hang on. Before we go in. Take bits off a team. I need to take bits as scope lens. Sorry, bits. You can't have that anymore. Now I need to figure out who I want to bring onto the team. Volcano is an idea. Iron Giant could work too. But I like the idea of bringing in either Jelly or Clover. No, uh, Shelly Dan, sorry, not Clover. Shelly Dan. I think Shelly Dan is the play though. I know it's a long grind to get to level 10, so almost level 44. And I'm probably gonna do, I'm definitely gonna need Visual Boy Advance to do it. But I think that's the better play over Jelly, because at least I can learn rock type moves with Shelly Dam, so I could have Rock Slide. So, uh, and I could have Earthquake possibly too. I don't really know what Shelly Dan, I don't know when, if Shelly Dan learns those kind of things, but we'll see. Anyway, if you enjoyed this video, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. I'm gonna need to do a lot of grinding in this and Pokemon Sword if you haven't watched. Uh... Oh wait, this, this won't come out. This will come out before Pokemon Sword. Spoilers for Pokemon Sword! But uh, yeah, this is going to be rather interesting. Anyway, if you enjoyed this video, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Until next time, I'm Lantern Joe. Mean to love Pokemon, get to Lazar. Everybody get Pokemon. Good night. Thank you so much for watching. If you did enjoy this video, please consider leaving a like, comment, and subscribing for more videos. And of course, if you ring the bell, you'll be notified first when those videos come out. You can follow me on Twitter at Lantern Joe, where you'll get news, thoughts, and opinions from me and the rest of the Lantern Nation. And of course, if you want to watch some more videos, there should be something in the top right and top left hand corner of this here end card. But until next time, I have been Lantern Joe, and I'll see you on the next video.